Sometime before Jesus took his disciples to the Garden of Gethsemane, Judas Iscariot, one of Jesus' twelve disciples, went to the chief priests and asked them, What are you willing to give me if I deliver Jesus over to you? They paid Judas thirty silver coins to carry out this deed. From then on, Judas was watching for an opportunity to hand over Jesus. After he had finished praying, Jesus was speaking to his disciples Peter, James, and John when he saw Judas approaching with a large crowd following behind. The chief priests and the elders had sent the crowd armed with swords and clubs. Hey, David Choate here from Share Faith Kids. Thank you so much for checking out this kids Bible video. Wanted to let you know that this video is part of an entire Sunday School lesson that includes curriculum, activity pages, a slideshow, family devotionals, and so much more. If you're interested and would like to explore this lesson a little bit further, please check out the link in the description below. As always, subscribe, like this video, and hit that bell for notifications. Uh, but for now, let's get you back to your video. Because the people in the crowd did not know what Jesus looked like, Judas arranged a signal so that they would know which person to arrest. Judas said, The one I kiss is the man. Arrest him. When Judas arrived at the garden, he walked right up to Jesus, said, Greetings, Rabbi, and kissed him. Jesus looked at Judas and said, Do what you came for, friend. Then the men in the crowd stepped forward, seized Jesus, and arrested him. One of the disciples who came to pray with Jesus in the garden saw what was happening, so he drew his sword and struck the servant of the high priest, cutting off his ear. Jesus told his disciple to put his sword away and explained that everything was happening just as it was supposed to and just as it should. Do you think I cannot call on my father to save me from this? But how then would the scriptures be fulfilled that say it must happen in this way? Jesus then turned to those in the angry crowd and said, Am I leading a rebellion that you have come out with swords and clubs to capture me? Every day I sat in the temple courts teaching and you did not arrest me. All of this is happening so that the writings of the prophets might be fulfilled. As it became clear that Jesus was going to be taken to the chief priests, Jesus' disciples fled in fear of being punished along with him. They abandoned Jesus 